Jonah Javad. This is an iconic night on the American sports calendar, the first round of the NFL draft. This year's NFL draft was one for the history books. It will unfold at home. Not only was it the first virtual one, it was the most watched NFL draft ever. You see the celebration in the Rager household. And it was a historic draft for TCU as well. It says a lot about what we've been able to accomplish. For the first time since 1939, two horned frogs were drafted in the first round. The Philadelphia Eagles select Jalen Rager. Star receiver and Waxahachie native Jalen Rager will now face his hometown Cowboys twice a year. Rager, touchdown! As a member of the Eagles. The Minnesota Vikings select Jeff Gladney. And cornerback Jeff Gladney figures to play a prominent role for the Vikings. Y'all had uh, two first round picks and three in the top 40 more than any other Texas college or university. How important is that to you? Obviously, we're very proud of what happened here. When you only have like 14 or 15 seniors, and you have 10 guys get into camp. That's pretty good odds. TCU head coach Gary Patterson had five players drafted this past weekend, and then five more frogs signed on as undrafted free agents, including both running backs, Darius Anderson and Shewu Alanalua, both going 20 miles down I-30 to the Cowboys. You have a five and seven season and you have 10 guys in, in camps. I don't think, I don't know how you can say better things about TCU. Not that it was a five and seven season, but you have 10 guys in camps. Uh, so people are coming to watch them. A lot of times people go, well, if they were five and seven, they must not have any players. And that is not the case. The NFL draft was one for the books. But I'm ready for the next chapter. In Dallas, I'm Jonah Javad.